Testing, testing, testing. Is this too dark? I'll probably get this big shadow right here, but whatever. I think we're okay. Testing, testing, testing. Hey, it's Keith from Outlaw Speed Shop, and this is just a quick video going over uh, some updates and some stuff coming up. Uh, first off, the Kenny Danner auction ended yesterday. Uh, last night around midnight, I think. We did $1,700. Um, that was before, obviously, eBay fees and shipping and so on and so forth. So, huge thanks to everybody who uh, who participated, who sent cars in um, from all over the world. And for those of you who also bid. Uh, let's see. I had to write notes because I can't remember shit. Um, Diecast Outcast has put forth a paint it pink challenge that is set to drop on October 12th and um, it's pretty much any car you want uh, as long as it has pink in it and I am going to be doing this pickup and I'm not sure what I'm going to do but I'm going to be doing it and we're going to be giving them away or we're all going to be doing something a little bit different um, but it's to raise awareness for breast cancer uh, I'm not really sure what I'm going to do with mine, if I'm going to auction it off or um, give it away or and then donate some money to um, a foundation. Um, everybody's doing something a little bit different, um, but the whole point is to raise awareness for breast cancer since October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month. Um, what else we got? Uh, Jamie over at Devil's Details Diecast has got five or six of us doing a Halloween build, and we're going to be doing the Skull Crusher. And if you're not familiar with the car, it's this monstrosity. Um, it's got a little skull on the back. Um, it's a skull. And we're going to be customizing it. Uh, that's going to go out on October 30th. And the only rule he has is on October 31st, we give it away to a um, subscriber. So anybody who comments in the video itself, uh, there's a tool that allows us to randomly pick um, a comment. So I will be giving it away. I'm um, looking forward to that. It's way, 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 way outside my normal builds. And I like those kinds of challenges. I already got some ideas floating around. Um, there is Kamikaze Custom Diecast, myself, Deep Junk Garage, Jim Silver, obviously Devil's Details Diecast, and Opa's Rex and Restorations will all be participating. Uh, if you're interested in participating, um, I'll have his email down below. The only thing that we ask is the uh, core of us are going to be doing the Skull Crusher. And if anybody else wants to participate, you can, but he just asks that you don't do the Skull Crusher. Pick any other car and do like a Halloween theme. Um, so yeah, that's on the 30th and then the 31st we give it away. Um, other than that, I've been kind of busy. i got a lot of stuff coming. I'm trying to up my builds a little bit. Um, it feels like all I'm doing is like wheel swaps or, you know, um, I don't know how to put it, but we, I mean, basic wheel swaps are great, but even though I'm painting and customizing and everything else, I want to get a little bit more in depth. So I went to um, a hobby shop about half an hour away. Um, it's not a big hobby lobby or anything. It's a local hobby shop. Um, guy contacted me on Instagram from the area and I never even knew this place existed. So I picked up a ton of brass rod and styrene and some brass and I finally got a jeweler saw. So I'm going to start getting a little bit more in depth with my builds. Um, something I always wanted to do, but it's it's kind of tough when you do video because you have to, you know, you got to put out a video a week. So there's not a lot of time to do in-depth customs. Um, and obviously I have a full-time job, so time is precious. And But I want to start doing a little bit more um, complicated builds instead of just paint and wheels, uh, which seems like that's the pattern I'm into. So I hope you guys don't mind. I'll still be doing those because um, I'm going to need filler. But at the same time, I want to start at least once a month doing a big build. So I um, hope you guys enjoy that. There'll be a little bit longer videos because they're more in-depth. But at the same time, I think um, it's a chance for me to really get into what I enjoy doing, which is fabricating. So um, anyways, this is just a quick video. Thank you guys for the um, support.
support. I really appreciate it. Uh, it's Sunday morning. I'm doing this live, sort of. Um, oh, by the way, uh, some of you may have gotten a notification that I was trying to go live yesterday. Um, I started to go live. Uh, I was supposed to be set to private with no notifications. That did not work. And uh, But regardless, um, I'm missing a few components to to make a quality live video. So I'm going to hold off on that for a while, but I do want to get into Q&A. And um, somebody has suggested I do a, a weekly or bi-weekly podcast uh, where I talk about customs and maybe interview some other um, customizers. If that's something you guys are interested in, uh, leave a comment down below. And uh, it's something I'd be interested in if I had enough support. So thank you guys, and I'll catch you on the next one.